Hi, I'm Tim Johnson. I'm the Chief Executive of the City of Wolverhampton Council. Uh, and we're a really proud member of the LGA's National Graduate Development Programme. The programme's been ongoing for us for 10 years or so, and we've attracted some brilliant talent across those years, working in a range of roles across the organisation. Uh, and it's been a real joy to see some of the graduates progress, both in their careers, both in Wolverhampton and elsewhere. And I'm really proud to say that some of the graduates that came through the programme have progressed to head to service level. One of the um, graduates is now part of our corporate management team and is one of our directors. So we are a really passionate advocate of the scheme. The calibre has been excellent. They've been so proactive and used their initiative, which has really helped. They've participated in projects where we wouldn't normally have had the capacity to undertake because of um, staffing capacity issues within the team, but also engaged with the organisation across the board with the various projects that we get involved in from a commercial perspective and a financial perspective, which are key skills really that are required in the public sector due to reducing funding and increasing demand for services. They've been a real asset, to be honest with you. It's given me a sense of routine, a sense of a real sense of drive since graduating. It's allowed me to develop on my professional skills as well, whether that be talking with senior colleagues, trying to learn about tone of voice. I think that is for me is one of the biggest ones. I got here 10 years ago and 10 years ago this was a very different council to what you see today. Um, it was quite old fashioned, certain things were very, as you'd imagine, local government. Whereas when the graduates came in and the work that started here 10 years ago, it was changing the way we do things, it's being more innovative, to the point where we won Local Authority of the Year. And some of the things that came from that was that different way of thinking, and every graduate that I work with had a different background, a different way of thinking, um, they studied different subjects at university or done masters and they just brought a bit of a, a, fre a bit of fresh air, I suppose, to the way that we do things. From very early on, I was given responsibility for sort of smaller projects or elements of projects, which gives you that overall skills basis for taking on larger projects as you move through your career. It also gives you the opportunity to build relationships with lots of different people, lots of different teams of all different levels of, of the organisation and other organisations as well. My final six months I took over the project management of one of our major corridor schemes which is where we put in uh, walking and cycling and bus infrastructure down some of the main major routes uh, between some of the town centres in, in the black country. The main aim of the scheme is to grow our managers and leaders for the future and as part of the scheme they get to undertake a level 7 qualification. So they're not only getting brilliant work experience within the, the council, but they're also getting that knowledge that they need to be the leaders that we need going forward. I think the NGDP was the best way for me to kickstart my career in local government because I had such a wide ranging um, experience across three different placements. I'd definitely recommend the NGDP to other councils. It's really straightforward to do. We get high calibre of candidates coming through and they're very supportive. They're there to help us. If you're a council thinking about participating in the programme, I couldn't uh, sponsor it enough. Um, it's been a brilliant opportunity to bring in new talent into the organisation and represents a fantastic value for money solution to ensuring that the sector can develop.